Okay. Stream my runes to life with a Stella Blade. Hey! hey what's up, guys? We're up here. So for months now, there's been a lot of drama surrounding the game Stellar Blade. And just when you yep. thought this discourse couldn't get any crazier, something it else happened. crazier. And that something else is another bounty being placed on someone's head. A threat to their life because they called be like, out the censorship. Pause the video. Pause the fucking video. How do you... How do you genuinely put up a bounty on someone's head in this age and time? Life! On Twitch! How do you do that? Even if it's quote-unquote met as a fucking joke, why do you do that? Oh my god, I just said the F words at the start of the video. I might get demonetized again. Fuck! Unlucky. ...one's head, a threat to their life, because they called out the censorship of this game, which is confirmed, by the way. It's more than just outfits. There is multiple aspects it's, of. It's so ridiculous. Like, um, bleep it out. You think I edit my videos? <laughs> I might cut it out, though. I might cut it out. Um, I've seen a video today, um, where people compared all the outfits, um, of Celebrate, where. The only censorship one is the bunny one, which is really weird. And obviously they made the gore, quote unquote, the gore less, which is less blood on Eve's body herself, which is a little bit confusing. Eve's hot, yeah, I mean, she is. She is, like, modeled after a hot woman. But no, this is unrealistic. <sighs> wow. Unrealistic body standards. Right, guys? Right? Stellar Blade that have been censored and these changes have been acknowledged by the director of Shift Up and all of this is a direct contradiction to the way that this game was advertised it's as to be an oh, it is actually release. though. Now one of the main people leading the charge against the censorship of Stellar Blade has been Mark Kerner known as his Twitter handle Grumps. Grumps. He has been calling out these acts of censorship and created a petition that hopes to revert these acts of censorship. Yes, it's an extra count. he's been targeted by a lot of people who are trying to attack him for calling out these acts of censorship. And he was once again trending yesterday and for some absolutely vile reasons. Now, we covered this tweet a few videos ago where someone offered $20,000 to anyone who could- You guys know what was ridiculous? I watched Esmond live on stream and he Grumps actually got shadow banned. Grumps was actually shadow banned after this. I saw it live on stream from Esmond. That was crazy. Like, what the fuck? Make Mark Kern disappear. This is responding to a tweet where he is showing uncensored outfits of Eve so you can compare them to the censored versions. This is the reaction someone had. A literal crime, by the way, putting a bounty on someone's actually. Life. Now, of course, Fucking I would cover Christ. that in a video that later Asmongold would react to yesterday Woo! called Normal People React to Stellar Blade Censorship, and we would get a reactionception here when the <laughs> Twitch streamer Denim's... We actually have a reactionception, an even deeper one as we are reacting to it. <laughs> TV would react to Asmongold's video reacting to my... Oops, sorry. Video. However, <laughs> me in reacting her reaction, to their videos. She would up the bounty to thirty thousand dollars. The bounty on Mark Kern's head. Fucking Christ, man. We just watched Listen, that. I'll up the number. That's okay? the clip we just watched. Thirty k to anyone who will make this dipshit <laughs> disappear and make Eve's breasts bigger. Ridiculous. Okay, you have to do both. All right. Because then it's a win-win for me. Like, what do you mean it's a win-win then -win for you? And I don't have to see that moron on my timeline anymore. Like, what is that even supposed to mean? So firstly, she wants the censorship to be gone. From what I understand, she wants bigger boobies. But she also doesn't want to see it, like... Like, this is literally just cloud. This is cloud chasing. This is just for fucking attention, man. What is this? Oh my god! But no, it's a joke. Haha, <laughs> clearly shown by booby person saying boobies. Yeah! Oh my god, it's just a joke, guys! It was a quirky! Ha! <laughs> it's obviously a joke. Oh my god, uh. <laughs> so if you think about it. Is this what fuck you said? Retard, man. Now, in case you're wondering at home, based on a fair interpretation of the law, 
what she did, what she said in that clip might constitute a felony in the United States. Mm -mm, now, for those mm. who don't understand what I constitutes is something going to as be. a felony, that means the violation of that law carries a minimum of one year in prison. So what she did might actually <laughs> land her in some very serious trouble. And no, I hope it is. adding the little joke at the end about it Eve's needs to be does not somehow cancel out what she had already said. Nope, now, because doesn't. she was reacting to Asmongold's video about this threat, there is some confusion as to whether she was addressing this comment towards Mark Kern or Asmongold's. Yeah, I thought it was towards Asmon as well, because the Asmon clip literally makes it look that way. Uh, but Hexagon earlier uh, uh, pointed out to me that it was about Grums, which I guess makes more sense. Or both of them. And this was Asmongold's reaction to seeing this clip. Because then it's a win-win for me. What a retard. I get more breath, Actually, though. And I don't have to see that moron on my timeline anymore. Oh, my God. So if you think about it. <clears throat> well. Oh, my God. She so makes aggressive? me so angry. Well, it's simple. So how do you deal with a situation like this? You report it. It's really it. easy. Uh, I contacted Twitch about it earlier. I yeah, sent it's them the fucked clip, up by the way. We'll it see is. What happens. And, you know, maybe after that, I, I might put in a police report. I'm going to just wait and see how I hope he did. Th this is unhinged. It it's completely unhinged. It's totally It's ridiculous. Yeah, this is like a felony. What is this? She's got me on the screen and she's saying that. Yeah, so um, I, I did see this. I thought it was quite ridiculous. We don't want her either. It's a <laughs> kind of a surprise. So obviously, like we've said, this is a very serious situation where what she said very clearly at the minimum violates the terms of service of all of the related platforms and also as many people claim is also broken the law as well she is in some hot water she's going to be dealing with a lot of headaches out of the situation which of course is a self-inflicted wound she said this under no pressure she did this openly and it's recorded in front of Yikes, a live man. audience for everyone to see Imagine. Now, there's been a lot of reaction to this tweet that's going around and here's some of the uh no, more popular on the other responses <laughs> this user saying Wow, I gotta look up what this guy did to get them to this point. Oh, he just said video games shouldn't be censored. Here's another one from Chibi Reviews saying, this is all over Stellar Blade, by the way. Woke up yeah, seeing a like, streamer what? putting a literal death bounty on someone's head for not liking censorship. This person legit needs mental help. Yeah, I Actually, feel like when you get kind of lost in the woods here, you're, you're doing all these arguments and people are getting uh, you know, back and forth with each other, you kind of forget what we're talking about. Obviously, these issues are important, right? Nobody wants the censorship of Stellar Blade. People want to speak out against it and get it reverted, hopefully, right? It's important to a lot of people, but it's not life and death. It is not life and death. And we're nope. at a point where people are putting multiple bounds. Like, at this point, the censorship shit is getting so out of fucking head. Hi, Uber. Thanks for following. Like, I didn't even want to make more videos about Stellar Blade, but... Here we are! Here we are! Like, I le legit just wanted to let, let that shit rest because I'm not that invested into the entire censorship shit. Like, it's ridiculous, right? But I didn't want to make, like, everything, oh my god, still bleed here, still right there. I wanted to play the game, um, that, that's about it, right? But this just coming up like that, like, I hope she, she gets repercussions. Is that the right word? I hope, um, she gets punished for this like she needs to get punished for this this needs to be set as an example as well like she did not make it seem like a fucking joke this does not seem like a joke like you can tell when someone sounds like they're joking right when they're like oh my god you should kill yourself that was a bad example <laughs> I'm stupid. What, what was I talking about? I don't even know anymore. Ponies ...on people's heads over the situation, over calling out censorship of a video game. If that is your People reaction that out of to someone calling yeah, out censorship, yeah, you are not so, well. So if you're wishing harm upon someone based on that, you are not well. And in this situation, it's very odd because we've seen all kinds of death threats be thrown at Asmongold, Mark Kern, even myself, from just random Twitter users, but you don't see people who are... I haven't had anyone send me a death threat yet. Can't wait to get my first one. Established Twitch streamers do stuff like this. I mean, that's why it's so crazy.
But moving on to another comment, this user said, the craziest part is if Grums threatens someone like that, no one would view it as a joke and it would make national headline news. And that is very true. If Mark Kern had made a threat like this against someone else, he would be annihilated. He'd be wiped off the face of the earth. Every platform he was on would be removing him, right? I think that's very obvious. However, in this situation, people are actually <laughs> trying to defend what she said and act like it's not that big of a deal. But we know if the roles were reversed in the situation, they would not be feeling the same. People would not aye, have aye, the same aye, view aye. because they dislike Mark Kern and they're trying to defend anyone who is going after him. And also this idea, if Mark Kern did this, people like me and other people who have been supportive of him would be critical of him if he made this threat. Actually, in fact, if Mark yes. Kern had made a bounty like this against someone else, I would have immediately dropped any- I don't understand. I don't understand. Why are the people so fucking upset over him making a petition? A petition! A petition doesn't say something is going to change. It just shows that a lot of people want the change. I don't understand! Where's the logic? Why do you hate on someone for just expressing that he wants the boop freedom? Which isn't, it's not actually even about the boobs itself. It's about the entire censorship uh, thing, the principle, right? So why are people so fucking upset about that? I don't understand. I don't understand. Please. Someone hit me and, and, and explain. Support for him because that would be unhinged. But in this situation, people are trying to justify it because they don't like him. In fact, this part about the joke is something that a lot because of people, people are, are doing. Insults. People are trying to claim Maybe, this is just but, a joke. But if people were insults, would they want the boobs? Would they want the boobs then? It's because people think it's cringe and people want booba, even though it's because people hate that they've been lied to, to with advertisement campaigns. <laughs> what? To them, the petition is like a crusade against their principles. They are scared they will lose. <sighs> that is so ridiculous. Imagine. Yo, Mika, what's up? What's up? Welcome in. And if this was, of course, reverse roles, they would not claim it was a joke. You can see Casey Tron here saying this. Oh, Casey Imagine Tron. Your biggest problem in life oh is God. female video game characters not showing enough skin. And when people make fun of you for it. Have you seen the recent quote unquote Casey Tron Esmongold drama. That shit was so funny. <laughs> that shit was so funny. Have you all seen that? <laughs> you pretend that you're getting death threats. The only thing you're a victim of is your own porn sickness. Of course, <laughs> calling everyone you don't like a porn addict how mature. But also Very you can see mature. multiple layers of denying the truth. They are trying to act like the censorship is only down to the outfits. When we know it's about more than just that, and it's also about broken promises from yes. Stellar Blade. They're trying to minimize what people are actually- They literally promised no censorships in any countries, and then it got censored. And then it got censored. I'm gonna say, I'm a Sony fangirl, right? I grew up with Sony, completely. I played Sony from the PlayStation 1 Os, but- Fuck you, Sony. This is ridiculous. Actually complaining about, and then in the same breath, are trying to claim that he wasn't getting death threats. The clip right. is literally right there, where she puts a bounty on his life. You can put the evidence and shove it right in their face, and they will still say it didn't happen. Whether it's with the censorship <laughs> or with these threats, they just pretend like it's not there because it suits their own agenda. In fact, I think Casey Tron's just mad because the other day she tried to go after Asmongold and he absolutely annihilated her with this <laughs> reply. I think she's still mad. Yeah, I, 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 I think this is the one I was talking about. Asmongold hates himself more than what any of us ever could. Just look at the lifestyle he chooses to live as a multimillionaire. There's nothing that could be said to that disgusting man that could ever make him change this filthy, hateful, putrid ways. Just a real stink. She also... There also was a live clip of her talking shit about him that he could have taken better care of his late mother. Which is... No. Like, you are such a piece of shit for saying that. What? Like, Esmond actually not even getting mad at that and actually just saying, Nope, you're fat. 
<laughs> I have so much respect for Asman for here because that was ridiculous the way she went out for him. Holy shit. About this. That's why she's making those comments. But moving forward, here's another comment saying, doesn't matter what you think of him, putting out hits, especially publicly like this, is not something that's a joke or funny. There is yep, no ground yep, yep. for free speech here. This is inciting physical harm against someone. I mean, how do you explain this any other way than exactly that? This is yep. not free speech. Free speech has its limits. You can't incite violence against people. What is she doing when she puts a bounty on someone's head and has a bounty out for their life? What is that other than inciting harm against someone else? And Actually, here's like, mindset. obviously an attorney, and this is his oh, perspective on the situation saying the comments hilariously destroy this woman. But the reality is this is a clear, unfair application of TOS, Twitch, YouTube, and X suspend accounts for saying far less True. And direct threats of violence and adding in a comment about Eve's breasts at the end does not change anything. Bro. She probably thought she was smart doing so. It's like people who say <laughs> in Minecraft, right? You see someone make a threat against- Go kill yourself in Minecraft, guys. In Minecraft. End your life in Minecraft, okay? YouTube, this is sarcasm. Someone else and they'll say, well, in Minecraft. That does not, you know, escalate that or de-escalate it to something lower than a threat. It's still a threat, even if you add in a little quib like that to make it a joke. It's still a threat. And she is aware yep. of this. So when this initially happened, her own viewers were saying that she did something very, very seriously wrong and said that they were calling the police on her over this Good. threat. And this was her initial reaction to people saying- I'm so happy that even her own quote unquote fans were holding her responsible. Holy shit. Actually. Saying that. And Roblox now if you want to be <laughs> saved my bet. Yeah, uh, accountable. That's the word I was looking for, actually. Not responsible. <laughs> Just love holding serious responsible. Uh, accountable. I call the police. Don't threaten people's life. Actually, man. I just love holding serious accountable. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so funny. It was just a joke, guys. Sir, if you show a cop that clip, he's gonna laugh in your face. No, he's not. Half of that clip is me talking about liking big boobs. So what? <laughs> so what? Well, as you can see, she's not laughing anymore. Did she as bet him? I don't know. Went viral on Twitter. She immediately privated her Bum -bum. account and she has gone into hiding, which is not surprising. Bum -bum. All of these people who make these crazy statements, the second they face any consequences or criticism, <laughs> they come immediately in private their <laughs> We've seen it happen with pretty much every single person involved in the Stellar Blade fiasco, and it's just predictable at this point. But really, the takeaway from all of this is people have gotten way too comfortable saying the most outrageous stuff actually, on social media. Actually, it, though. Okay? Some of these things are heated topics. People insult each other. People make fun of each other. People criticize each other. But when it gets to a point where a conversation about censorship of a video game <laughs> gets to a point where people are having threats on their lives, like, what are we doing? People are way too comfortable in this Mike Tyson quote. Winter will live on forever yeah. because people keep doing this. Itch. People keep acting like they can say whatever they want with no consequences just because they feel... Yeah. People need to have consequences, man. There need to be consequences. This needs to have consequences. No. No. It's, it's time to fucking stop. People need to be held responsible and accountable. People need to get fucking consequences. People need to get deplatformed. God. Basically empowered by their moral disagreement over censorship of a video Jailed, game character yes. and how we should view it. But moving forward, here's Mark Kern's response to everything he says. Yes, I'm upset about a streamer uh, upping the joke bounty on my head. But I decided everything, I deleted everything except the video clip to keep the focus. All Good of this because people want to stop the petition. Sign it today and make it all worth it. You can see his petition and the related hashtag, hashtag free stuff. Actually Blade, sign it, man. Which unfortunately now has been censored by Twitter. No! It's not too surprising. They tend to clamp down on things like this all the time. 
but the hashtag Freestellar Blade has been censored on Twitter. Of but course despite it has. That, despite this hashtag being hidden by Where Twitter it, it, over 24 uh, hours ago, in I'll that check, same time uh, period, I'll check it in a the moment. petition has grown by over 20,000 signatures. I'll check it in a moment. And it's now up to 55,000 in total, which is absolutely nice. Crazy, and again, I'll put a link to this in the description. Go ahead and give that a signature. Yeah, and I'll link it to you after the video is done. So hopefully, we can get these censorships rolled back. Now, again, I think it's important to take a step back and just realize how far things have gone. A it's conversation ridiculous. about censorship of a video game has led to such extreme reactions, and the people making these threats and alike, they think they're the normal ones in the <laughs> situation, and it's totally insane it is hard to understand why people are so threatened by someone calling out very visible censorship of a video game that they were promised that the customer was promised it wouldn't, wouldn't be censored get censored why yep. are people so angry about those calling it out it's truly a honestly and before we go there's one more thing i want to point out so you guys know I work with Advanced GG, Yo! and they have new lines of stuff coming out here. You can see their nice selection here. I always love this little formula setup they got for their focus, energy, and hydration. And I wanted to add this in at the end because they returned the lemonade hydration flavor, which I know is a fan favorite among you among you guys. So I wanted to let you know that that is back. And of course, use code REV at checkout for 10% off of your order. But for now, that is the news and i hope you guys enjoyed the video as always feel free to share your thoughts about today's topics in the comment section down below and i'll see you guys next time holy shit this is ridiculous no 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 don't play Oi! saved saved <laughs> no copyright <laughs> saved yo yo what's up what's up what's up what's up um, right, let me link this video to y'all, and I'll get y'all the petition ready. I'll, I'll probably put the petition in my YouTube video as, uh, as well once this video is live, man. Oh, apparently it's a Twitter link? No, wait, here's the petition itself. Here's the petition, change.org. There you guys go. Here you guys go. I'll get... I'll put this petition down too. 65k not uh is currently signed. 65k currently. Jesus.